I'm Sarah Cliff. This is Claysmore School Shop. In here, we sell all the uniform and sports kit that your children will need from the age of two and a half to, to 18. In the nursery and the pre-prep, we have some very tiny clothes, some Airtex shirts and tracksuit for nursery. And then as they go into pre-prep, the girls have kilts and the boys have some gray shorts. Um, as they go into the prep school, the girls move into a somewhat longer kilt and they have a white shirt and the boys wear a checked blue shirt with charcoal grey trousers. The prep school children have a unisex blazer which is very interesting because we all have to learn which side to put our buttons. My advice is to look at what shirt you have and put the buttons on the same side as the shirt. Something to do with sword carrying in men. Um, the prep school have a Airtex, well it's a sort of Air Force blue jumper um, and the girls wear cardigans. Um, when they get into the senior school the boys move into a much more grown up navy and white shirt and a navy blazer. Let me just show you this one. Now, this is a bonus because the buttons are already on this one. In the girls, the girls have a pretty pink and white shirt. Now, the pink the shirt sits on the outside of the kilt because um, it's a, it's fitted here. The, their blazers are slightly simpler and they have a pleated kilt to go with it. We also this year have an option for the girls to have navy trousers. However, they are Claysmore navy trousers rather than just any navy trousers. But I'll talk about the ordering and the order form in a few minutes. We have a number of different coats available. One of the most favourite ones, and it doesn't matter that they're not 100% waterproof, is the puffer jacket. You'll find when you arrive, most of the children, when it gets to coat time, go for a puffer jacket. But as I say, they are not 100% waterproof. The, bit, the waterproof coat is more, like, is more like a Mac, and that is a waterproof coat, and it's brilliant if you're doing games a lot. Um, it'll be much, it's actually a much better coat than the puffer jacket, but the the students like the puffer jacket. And then for the big sports enthusiasts, particularly rugby and particularly um, the girls when they play hockey, um, we have the most lovely subcoats. And these are huge, but they're meant to be huge. Sports kit wise, we have the same sports kit from the prep school through to the 18 year olds. Um, the it's quite it's unisex so that means that when you look at a pair of tracksuit trousers let's get one out um they are quite baggy the way that they're sized is by the waist so if you need a bigger waist you buy a bigger waist and you get longer legs but as you can see they're quite um shapeless but they're very soft and very easy to wear. The other thing that's, a couple of other things about the sportswear that's worth mentioning when it comes to sorting out what sizes you want. Um, the rugby shirts are quite generous in size. I mean, like, this is a tiny one, but they are, they are quite generous in size. They have quite long arms. The rugby shorts are quite tight because they have, they have elastic in the waist which is where you tuck your rugby shirt in and it becomes more difficult to pull it out um, but this makes them quite tight around the waist so sometimes you may need a size up on rugby shorts compared to what you might have in the ordinary PE shorts the T-shirts are the same, boys and girls. 
Oh, that's a really tiny one. This is an example of the fact that we do go quite small. Um, and the sweatshirts are the same across throughout the school. Rather nice, they've got clothes more on the back as well. In the summer, what we have of it, we have um, cricket wear for the boys and, and the girls for that matter, if they're playing cricket. And we have recently introduced a netball dress for the girls. Um, netball is usually um, from the January term, the spring term. So uh, not necessarily something that needs to be bought straight away, but um, they've been very popular this year. We also do swimming costumes um, and swimming trunks. As I get again, right down to the tiniest sizes. Like that. Through to the biggest. Swimming costumes are really quite difficult to fit and you may well need to get a bigger size than you think you need because they are the same shape. I mean, if you or I were going to buy a swimming costume, we'd probably choose different shapes. But these are standard school ones, so it's exactly the same shape as swimming costume, just bigger. So that might be something that perhaps is bought once your child has started school rather than necessarily um, um, through an online system. Normally, every year, we have from about May to um, August, um, people coming through here all the time with appointments for fittings so that they can actually see and try on the uniform and then take it away or leave it with us for naming. This year, um, we're not allowed to use the fitting rooms and we're not allowed to do trying on because of the COVID-19 regulations. Also, this shop is really quite small, so it makes social distancing quite difficult. So we're utilising the My School Portal system, and on there you'll find an online ordering form, which will list all the uniform that your children need. It will also have the recommended quantities that you, sh you should buy, and we will take your order from there and process it here. If you've got any queries about it, or you don't understand any of it, or you want to discuss any of it, you just need to contact the shop. The best way will be via email, and that will get monitored and picked up, and then we can arrange a telephone call if we need to. For example, around swimming costume or shorts, or any bit of gear that you feel a bit more uncomfortable about. One of the things on that list you'll find is that there is a reference to school trousers, but I don't stock school trousers. That's because charcoal grey trousers can be bought from a number of other stores, of which I am not going to name any of them. Um, whereas, for example, the blazer is unique to the school. We stock the items that are unique to the school. Um, I don't have any equipment and I don't have any stationery. So th things like hockey sticks and trainers and school shoes and rulers and felt tips, will, um, you'll need to um, organise separately. 